Hey everybody, how's it going? It is Axel Grave, and I'm back with more reactions with an X. Super happy to bring you some more One Piece. And we are on episode 986, Fighting Music. I think this is going to be a fun episode. I do know how things are going to play out. As you guys know, I read the manga. I'm not going to get into that. We've had that spiel a billion times, and it hasn't changed since last week. I'll let you know when it changes. But I am excited to get into more episodes. I'm hoping that as we move into more action-packed portions of this particular um exchange that will get less of these kind of fillery moments these kind of drawn out moments that we've gotten for the last couple episodes that's not to say that they're always bad but it's definitely been less impressive than the episodes before however what i will say is these episodes have been heavy in artistic expression as far as the art which i usually don't even comment on because i don't notice but it's so striking and different in some of these past episodes that i haven't been able to help myself but to say hey that looks intriguing and I'm hoping it continues in this one as well, especially as we go into more action. I'm hoping they keep with that idea of let's do more artistic things and not just kind of stick with these movie cinematic shots that have become kind of standard in a lot of places. With that said, as always, remember to support the original content creator because without them, we don't get more of this amazing content. Achira Oda, the Goat of the God, is one of my favorite authors, if not my favorite author. And I would like you to support him. Please. But if you can't, like me, remember to just do your best to tell other people to as well. <laughs> and uh, yeah, if you're a patron, thank you guys so much. I really do appreciate all your support. Without you, we wouldn't be able to do so many episodes every week. And we wouldn't be able to give out the kind of uh, bonuses that we do currently. So thank you to all our patrons. As always, you guys will get this episode uncut and uh, available a week early. So yeah, hope you guys enjoy that. With that said, we're going to go ahead and get right into it. Let me know what you guys think in the comments or on our Discord channel link below, and we can uh, chat it up about this episode later. So I don't know about you guys, but uh, personally, oh no, not another fucking... No! No! I get it. This is actually... This is actually better than it was in the last episode for some reason. But it's still, we get it. They intentionally spilled it. Then I'm just going to have to cut them all. That was a little... Look at the accordion face. <laughs> I can't, bro. That's so fucking funny. At least he knows. We had no choice. <laughs> we had no choice since Red Meat Soup was on. Oh, yeah. I forgot he doesn't like a poo. Damn, he looks scary in that, but also weird. Like, he feels like he's rounder than usual. Damn, it really is creepy the way they're drawing him. Here we go, finally. Damn, that was pretty dope art there. A little misleading because he didn't cut through the whole building, but you know what I mean? That's right, it wasn't the other that. Toby, uh, Queen had a problem with someone in the Toby Ropo. That's right. I thought it was the other way around. I had forgotten. I do. I'm not going to say it. I'm not going to say it. I'm not going to say it. All right, I didn't say it. I got close. But I didn't say it. And there uh there's the Toby Ropo. They actually look pretty good too, but I don't know, man. The Toby Ropo for me are interesting, but they they're I don't know. Yeah, so a spot in the Toby Ropo. And it's back to his theme song.
but can you collect? Oh my god, he has a fox in his chest, right? Her face looks creepy. I say with my face. And that's when Kaido showed up, yep. And we all know how he was already with, uh, Scratch Man Apu was already with Kaido at this point. We really didn't need a replay of this. Although it is cool that they linked the two scenes because I think they were separate in the, uh, in the, in the anime. Or previously. <laughs> to be fair, that's like the third or fourth fucking Warlord Luffy took down. Crocodile, then Moria. And then uh, Flamingo. Okay, maybe it was just three. Jeez, this is a huge fucking flashback bro jesus bro this is a ho this whole thing's getting cut that's so fucked damn cut the so and spear nice ooh nice little oh this it feels so different every episode's art direction it this one isn't even that special but it's just different than the previous Here we go. Oh, is it supposed to be scratch? It was supposed to be pal. Can't see sound. There we go. That one matched. The other one did too. Slash merch. His face, what is wrong with it in that? Look at it. He looks like a slug caterpillar coming out of his... Oh my god. What was that? Oh, damn. He cut his neck. They never show that kind of stuff. I thought he had a... Fucking bit the fox's mouth shut. Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> Are you fucking kidding me? Yep, there he goes. Yeah, but he don't care. He just wants this. Oh, all right. Look at that. It's like distorting the screen. See that? And it's like VHS, which is cool because it's like electromagnetic interference. Oh, okay. <laughs> the way he said that was not at all with an exclamation point. Surprise. Most unsurprising surprise. The fact that he doesn't notice this is just kind of... Okay, there we go. Yeah, it's like... I like how he didn't use the hand that's already metal to do this. Figure that might be, like, an easier starting point than just adding metal to your other hand. I feel like Apu had plenty of time to prepare for that. Yeah, and didn't. Yeah, there's that. Yep, 
Yeah, they made it seem almost like he killed him, but I don't think he did in the in the manga. But I, you see, I'm leaning forward in my chair because this shit's actually really dope. They did it again too, by the way. They took those amazing creative decisions artistically and added them to the story here. Although I do still think Kid looks weird at times with his face being a little round. There we go. That that was good. I I will forgive the three minute back fucking story or whatever for that because that was really cool to see punk gibson and just to see the the style they chose to use with his like electrical powers interfering with the video that was fucking dope that was such a cool little science nod and like i love it when science i like science fiction so like fiction and fantasy are a little different and if you don't know the difference i'm not going to explain it to you now go watch a youtube video but essentially like one Piece and then border on the line between science fiction and fantasy. And because of that, we get these really cool, like, semi-lucid explanations for powers, right? Where, like, Luffy, Luffy's powers kind of make sense, right? For someone who was made of rubber. And same with Kid, right? Like, if the electromagnetic field is his what he's manipulating to do this, which he must be if you go by a science perspective and not just a pure magic perspective, it would interfere with the video waves and the electromagnetic light waves that go around, so... It, it was cool. I thought it was so awesome to see that. The The rest of it was all right. I mean, I wasn't too pumped until we really got in that section of a little bit more Apu and Kid in this one. And before that, it was really like lead up and like kind of bullshitting around. And it, it was really more stretched out, which I understand. I know why they do these things. It's just sometimes it's a little irksome when you're in the middle of these really great story action pieces and to have them kind of drag on. So I'm glad that at least the end of the episode felt like it was very, very, like, popping. With that said, guys, I hope you really enjoyed watching. I know I did. If you did enjoy watching, remember to support the original content creator. Right, 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 right. Yeah. Support the original content. Oh, I can't talk. The original content creator, uh, either on Shonen Jump or on Crunchyroll or whatever, wherever you buy the manga or, re or watch the anime, etc. Check it out there. If you enjoyed watching with us, like comment subscribe tell us what you thought hit the notification bell if you want to see more and if you want to see this uncut with its full video glory no overlays all the audio check out our patreon where you can get it up to a week early for uh, i'd say just about a dollar a month usd and uh yeah that'll be it for this week's episode guys i hope you enjoyed episode 986 i'm axel grave and this has been reactions with an x one piece <laughs>